Welcome back to another episode of NASA Space News. Red giants are dying stars. They are luminous with low or intermediate mass in a late phase of stellar evolution. Scientists from the Instituto de Astrofisica y Ciencias do Espaço, or AI, have led a team of astronomers to discover that the inner cores of these massive stars undergo sudden and drastic oscillations, or glitches. Researchers explain that these tiny variations in stellar brightness are caused by waves of moving within the stars and may be observed using precision-based instruments. These waves indicate the medium characteristics or the star interiors through which they travel. The scientists utilize data from the Klepper Space Telescope at NASA to discover and analyze waves spreading to the deepest layers of evolving stars. They claim to have found the first characterization of structural discontinuities in the cores of red giant stars, making it possible to accurately sound the physical processes taking place there. By also studying these shifts, astronomers may learn not only about the star's overall properties, but also its inner structure. Many astrophysical studies use low-mass red giants, with helium burning in their cores as a way to measure distance, a metric of features like galaxy density and a tool for understanding the fundamental mechanisms behind star chemical evolution. The goal is to know what causes these breaks in behavior so scientists can develop accurate models of them. In this study, they looked at 359 red giants with masses below a particular threshold, analyzing their properties and unique oscillation frequencies. They found that about 7% of these stars had noticeable gaps in their structure. Two basic theories try to explain the mechanisms behind these disturbances. The first theory claims that glitches occur repeatedly during the star's life, but are often too small to be considered by astronomers as genuine breaks in the evolution of the star. The second theory indicates that these abnormalities are smoothed out by an as-of-yet unidentified physical process, which then causes modifications to the central structure of the star. As it turns out, the first scenario is not supported by this study, but more precise data is needed before scientists can confidently subscribe to the second. And according to the team, this study shows the limits of their models, and it gives an opportunity to find a way for improving them. That's all for now. Make sure you don't miss any updates by subscribing to the channel. Also, don't forget to check out previous videos, and for up-to-the-minute updates, visit the website at www.nasaspacenews.com. Thanks for watching.